it's all right. These things happen. Take it out. Cry. Right. We're together. We've been looking forward to that. Lincoln Center is 24 hours away. What are you doing, Spartan Swanson? Me? Nothing. Why don't you come over to me and have dinner? Thank you. But this is going to make our office time. What? You told me they wouldn't be needed. Oh, no. Because let's try to dinner party. But the strategy is canceled. Yes, but they didn't cancel until Thursday night, and I didn't get the message until this morning. But then, the cook and the maid were gone. It's the fucking end of the world. It's not your fault. You didn't know the strategy was canceled. I was thinking about that. It's so awful. Thank you. 
That's not going to drive me much. How do you know so much about this? I'm very interested in You look like you're in good shape. Thank you. I'm very strong for women. You look very strong. Too strong? Don't be silly. You can't look too strong. The appearance of strength is the appearance of power. Do you know the real difference between men and women, Mr. Virgin? Strength. Here, physical strength. Do you know that there are fish that change sex when a bigger fish comes along? Because only the biggest fish can be a male. All the rest of the fish are in here. You're joking! Absolutely not. <laughs> the bigger fish have down to such a science that they don't even have to fight. All they need is a measure. And the fish that looks most likely to inflict injury wins. Well, it certainly as well with your fish, isn't it? That's not my point, Mr. Richard. The point is, it's not whether you're a man or a woman who determines, or determines who you are. It's how strong you are that determines whether you're a man or a woman. Metaphorically, of course. Well, I see. I'm very strong. You are very strong. You know, John, I'm glad you're not you don't know the idiots I had to do before you came along. I'm glad you're here, Jane. Joan. What will I try to do my job? Joan? This is so embarrassing. Hello. I'm so, such a fool. No, not at all. To, to have had you as my secretary for so long and not know your first name? Well, you don't call me by my first name.
What? <laughs> <laughs> I went to school in Switzerland and Swiss food is just a part of looking for a reason. <laughs>
<laughs> Obviously, I mean, I wouldn't be paying a year's secretary more than 30000 a year. And that's what I'll be paying you, more than 30000 a year. How much more? We'll see. <laughs> Some secretaries make 100000 a year. Very, very cute. <laughs>
wonder if this, this is what was suggested by what he said. When he said in his book, and he wrote about the, the one choice Mrs. Rodney. Have you read Dostoevsky's journals, Mr. Rodney? Who's Dostoevsky? Yeah. <laughs>